slash IMAP tab uh, is the fifth one over. Click on that, and then uh, you'll see the forwarding section. Click to add a forwarding address, and here I'm just going to add the email address I would like my emails to be forwarded to. Okay, that's going to send an email to that address and that email looks just like this. You notice it has a confirmation code um, which I could just enter into that box or I could click this link here verified. Uh, I need to refresh this page and that is the same as filling in that box there. Okay, uh, now the final step, if you don't do this, uh, nothing will happen, is to actually enable the forwarding. So I click that radio button there that says forward a copy of incoming mail. Um, I want to archive the copy in um, this account. I won't be checking it, so I'll just uh, assume that it was read in my other email. Save changes. And to test this out now, I have an email ready to send to this address, which should be forwarded to here. And for the sake of demonstration, I am sending it from a third address. Hit send. 